18 thing. Yeah. You know, you know. How you doing, ladies and gentlemen? Your boy OP with a wit television. How y'all doing today, tonight, tomorrow, whatever time you guys decide to watch the video? Um, I think I just do do these videos on Monday, uh, just to get a full week, just to get news in. Uh, you know, everything moving slowly. You know, the draft is upon us. Um, well, not upon us, but the, the combine is upon us. Everything's kind of moving slow, so I'm just trying to wait to get all the news and everything like that. I know Kendrick. McKendrick was released from the Vikings. Uh, uh, it was a corner release. Shaquille, Shaquille, he was released from Jacksonville. I think Frank Clark about to get released. Um, so a lot of people, a lot of good people get released. Um, Tennessee released their left tackle. I can't think of his name right now off the top of the head. But, you know, it's a lot of people coming in, but it's a lot of people are it's going out. So it's like, you know, you look at the money situation. Like, how can we get players in? Um, I know they're talking about looking at Baker Mayfield and Rudolph at quarterback as the backup. And then speculation still talking about Tom Brady coming to the league. But, you know, they're speaking on Miami. Um, so it's a lot of things. It's a lot of things to look at. But, you know, the... the I looked at an article and said the main things for us to deal with is another quarterback. You know, we already talked about that. You know, bringing in third quarterback. Um, a lot of people, well, me personally, I'm going to say me. I like Baker Mayfield as a backup. As a starter, no. I love him as a backup. Um, him, um, Tyrod Taylor. Um, I wouldn't even mind. Um, well, I really like Mariota. Uh, if, the, if the money right, if if, if the money right, uh, I would go with them three, uh, just to get us in there, just to get somebody in competition, get that veteran competition in. Um, next, they talk about kicker. They say it's a 50-50 chance that uh, Robbie Gold leaves. Um, I'm not gonna say kicker's not important. Kickers are very important, especially for them clutch kicks. Robbie Gold is very, very, very good at clutch kicking. Hopefully, we get him back. And of course, they already said they're not going to franchise tag him. So, you know, that's one thing I like about the 49 We're not going to force you to stay with us. And it's not in a bad way. It's like, you know, if you want to be here, please be here. If you don't, look, we're not going to keep you here. We're not going to force you to be here. Save that money. Who, like 10 mil? Something like that for the franchise tag? Something like that? Like, man, we got time for that. If you're going to sign with us, you're going to sign with us. Uh, they're talking about working on the defensive line. And I know it's a lot of if possible situations, you know, especially like people restructuring contracts or people trading. I think we're talking about trading De uh, Ormstead. Uh, me personally, I'll try to keep him, try to get Sosa back. Um, like I said, we already talked about Davenport and them guys, Clowney. You know, just clean up the mix, you know, change the mix up a little bit. Um, that'd be smooth. I know they talked about McGlinchey. They talked about right tackles. And like I said, you know, it's a lot of players getting released. It's a lot of players that we can deal with, a lot of players we can get back in the system. Uh, McGlinchey. And of course, he's gonna want his money. He did decent. I mean, he did good to be honest. But it's like you know, what can we do? You know, we we we, we got to keep our money. We got to make sure we can be able to pay our players. But we still got to make sure that we get players in. Um, we actually talked about safety. I know Shanahan was talking about uh, Gibson. He liked Gibson at the free safety position, you know, because he that boy go for the ball, <laughs> plain and simple. You know, we got uh, Jimmy Ward out there. Um, you know, he wanted to play safe. He don't want to play the nickel. But that's one of those scenarios. Gibson did a good job at safety. Jimmy did great at nickel. So it's like, okay. I mean, trust me, man. We, we could find another nickel. But it's like, you know, you got to figure something out in that situation. I love Jimmy. Jimmy Ward doing that since he's been in the league. Uh, turn down money to go to the Raiders. More money to stay at the Niners. Uh, I, I just like him on the team. He's a great captain. He's a great player there. Um, if we lose him, it's going to suck. But at the same time, it's like, hey, we got to do what we got to do. Um, oh, I know they're talking about, uh, what's his name? Jalen Ramsey. I know it's having to do with the safety. They're talking about shipping him off. I doubt they'd come to the 49ers. But at the same time, it's like, you know, this is wishful thinking. I would love to have him and, and Traveris Ward out there. Then I move... Uh, Yamadola knowing the nickel. Hey, you know what I'm saying? So it's like scenarios like that can happen. Shaquille, 
bring him over there. Uh, you know, it, it's just little thoughts, little thoughts, little thoughts, little thoughts. Not serious, not serious. Uh, we talk about replacing the center. You know, we lose our center. I uh, wish we still had Alex Mack. Alex Mack's decent. I like Alex Mack. Uh, but, you know, we, we got to figure out the sign of these guys, man. We got to figure out who we going to put in that system. Who can we fix and replace? That's the main thing. I know Shanahan and them, and them guys is going to look at the uh, – Look at the the draft and everything like that, but it's like you know you want somebody that's in the field ready, already ready to go. Uh, a lot of these times we're not gonna really have these players ready to go, but hey, we find diamonds in the rough somehow. We just this is what we do. Um, you know, uh, Brock Purdy supposed to go into surgery on Friday, so we're gonna see how that pans out. Um, uh, you know, we still got that dilemma with the quarterback situation. We still dealing with, you know, Trey or Brock. But I know Brock is in a situation where he just he just gonna have to figure it out, you know. He got his injury going on. Um, it's gonna be tough for him. You know, I, you, we gotta see how he comes back. We gotta see how he comes back and how well he's gonna be. Uh, his situation a little different, you know, he's coming fresh off an of injury. As well as Trey, as well as Trey. But uh Brock Purdy injury is a little bit fresher than Trey. Uh, so, like I said, me personally, I think I, I would love to have a two quarterback system. Uh, get a solid third string quarterback. I know they were talking about having having teams be able to have three quarterbacks on the roster at one time. That's something that needs to be done because we, we 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 always fall short because of a quarterback situation. That's the only thing we really fall short on is one our quarterbacks. Right? And I know uh, I doubt we signed Jimmy G back. Uh, I know they talking about the Raiders got interest in him, Washington and stuff like that. So it's like, hey, we got to find a solid third string quarterback. I'm honestly say a third string quarterback because we got two stars. Uh, so it's like, you know, we got to figure something out. Um, like I said, the young boys in the draft, is it possible we draft a quarterback? <laughs> you know, it sounds wild, but at the same time, it's like, you know, you got two kind of vets and Brock and then Trey, but at the same time you need that veteran veteran. You know what I'm saying? Like somebody been in the league long enough to understand the game, but at the same time you don't want to pass up on a young talent. But at the same time, it'd be a waste of a pick because you got two young talents on your team, so it's like we stuck in the rock in the hard place. Uh, we still got to sign a lot of players. Like I said, they were looking at some DNs, some D tackles, some corners and receivers and all them guys. Linebackers, we need to go ahead and grab some people up. Um, because right now we just need to replace players right now. Potentially t- people that gonna leave, like your Shaiers and your uh, Wards and your Sosa that could potentially leave. I uh, really wish them guys could stay. I really wish we could keep everybody on the roster, but you know, at the end of the day, it's a business. Uh, same thing, you know, we gotta get <laughs> we gotta get Brandon Ayuk and Bosa on the contract. So it's like you know, it's a lot of stuff we gotta deal with. So I'm pretty sure a lot of contracts gonna get restructured and stuff like that. So. It's going to save some kind of money. Um, but, yeah, the main people I really, 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 really wish we could keep, you know, the Robbie Gold, great player, great rock and locker room player, Jimmy Ward, Al Shair. Um, I really want McGlinchey, um, you know, keep him in there. It's like, you got the team that's already solid for a Super Bowl. We just need to keep a quarterback healthy. That's all we need. <laughs> we got McCaffrey. We got a team. We got a solid team. So, it's like. Who is at the helm going to have to go ahead and helm and hold it down. And I, I like having Christian McCaffrey. I know a lot of people talk about, yeah, why don't you trade Debo, trade Debo. I'm not letting Debo go. Why, man? We got Christian McCaffrey. But I understand that. I understand that. Keep two weapons, man. If you're able to have two guns and go on the street, once you want to keep two guns, you're not going to put one down because you have another gun. No, you want two of them. So, I know a lot of people talk about, yeah, we need a deep threat receiver. I mean, potentially, or oh, really, to be honest with you, bring that you our deep threat right now we got Ray Ray McLeod you know so I, we got Danny uh, Danny Gray like we got deep threat receivers man we got receivers man Debo just happened to be a switch knife a switch knife how you say it switch knife switch knife whatever it is he's like he that he that person to be able to do everything so I'm willing to keep him I want to keep him point blank period that's how I feel about it but I'm not gonna hold you guys too long like I said I'm dropping these videos on Monday um I got Legend League uh, Madden games that I post up here. I'm trying to separate them too, uh, so you know they all gonna be in a different little playlist. I'm actually trying to do um, exhibition games as well. 
I'm just tuning myself up for that, you know, get them videos out. Like I said, man, it's all about business. <laughs> I feel like I'm in the NFL, man. I got work to do. Uh, but I'm always going to drop these 49 videos. That's one thing I'm never going to stop doing. Uh, but the mad situation is something new. I'm just trying something new. Just trying to figure this YouTube thing out. So, like I said, I really, really, really appreciate you guys. I'm not going to hold y'all too long. Like, share. Oh, like, share, comment, subscribe. Hit that notification bell. Like I said, I really, really appreciate it. I really appreciate my new subscribe, my old subscribe, my favorite subscribe. Really, 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 really appreciate y'all. Y'all have a good night, good morning, good evening, every time you guys start watching the video. They try to press you down. Scratch your frame with the hand touching